So Boris Johnson not offering a whole lot of options here. No, he's kind of coming up with an ultimatum to the EU saying, here's my final offer, even though he hasn't made many offers, uh, take it or leave it or we will leave. Uh, the, he will lead the UK out on October 31st. He says if this deal does not uh, is not accepted, he's calling it a fair and reasonable compromise. Um, yet it does not include this Irish backstop that was in the previous deal. Uh, he's also vowing to not seek a delay, uh, even though the Parliament has passed legislation that says he must do that if he had, doesn't have a deal. So he's saying he's he's going to you know this is it. This is the the final offer. Hmm. Uh, yeah, Jody, it does all hinge on that Irish backstop, doesn't it? What is the proposal from jo Boris Johnson around Northern Ireland, and is it feasible? Well, that's a real question, whether it's feasible and, and whether it would be accepted. But his proposal basically is to have, a, have Northern Ireland in a temporary regime uh, that with a time limit, and it would require customs checks at the border between uh, Northern Ireland and the Republic of Ireland. And, of course, that has been opposed by both the EU and, uh, and Ireland. His concern is that... Uh, and, and hardline Brexiteers all along have had the concern that the, the so-called Irish backstop would uh, keep the uh, UK in a linked, essentially, to the EU uh, indefinitely. And that's something that he has said he wants to avoid. But whether this would be acceptable to the EU and then to the Parliament is the real question, whether, and whether it would be workable.